Hi, everybody. Big welcome to you all to Manchester, to the Etihad Stadium. And it's Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler. And today, it's Manchester City against Newcastle United. Here is the Manchester City man. Number two, Kyle Walker. Number four, Vincent Company. Number five, John Stone. Number 30, Nicholas Otamendi. Number three, Number Kevin De Bruyne, a wide range of skills, an attacking midfield player, Kevin off the front, wide areas, Number got plenty 21. of goals in him. No, I'd expect him to be at the centre of things today because he can go both ways. He's he's so hard to beat. Well, the opponents to this team, they know what to expect, but stopping them, Alan, that's a different matter altogether. Yes, quite, and uh, any opposition manager would have spoken uh, long and hard about their game plan, but uh, it's a wonderful way of playing, the passing, the movements. It's unstoppable when it's uh, hitting top form. Newcastle United's lineup. Tim Krul starts in goal. Jesus Gámez starts in Manquillo as the wide defenders. Jack Colback starts with Mikel Merino in central midfield. And they've got plenty of goal threat with two strikers in the attack. Manchester City have got a decent result in their last game. It was away from home. And they drew against Liverpool. No, I mean, a bit unlucky in the nil-nil draw. Forwards had plenty of chances. I think they'll make amends with a win today. Our referee is Chris Kavanagh. <laughs> Manchester City has started this first half. Kevin De Bruyne looking to get the ball forward here. Manchester City. Silva. The shot's on. And he blocked it then. Chance to cross it. Gabriel Jesus. Now De Bruyne. And now the shot. Oh, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. It's a corner for Manchester City. Corner played in. It's not really away. Poor clearance. Nicholas Otamendi. Aguero. Keeper pushes it away from the goal. Corner now for Manchester City. Bruyne's delivery, it's a good leap, but the header too high. Yeah, unlucky, give him another chance, I think he'll tuck that away. It's been a recurring theme for Pep Guardiola, too many missed chances, and there's another one. A chance goes begging to put his team ahead. CM De Jong. And here they are on the attack. It's with De Jong. It was good play until they got that challenge in. Now Danilo. Now David Silva gets it back. Can whip it in now. So they can regroup now at a goal kick. 
coming up for you on EA Sports. Don't forget, don't miss this, the coverage of the Premier League fixture. Manchester City will be hosting West Bromwich Albion. Yeah, really looking forward to this one. Uh, I think we're going to see some good football. On to the attack now. Nicely uh, done to keep on his feet and not just go to ground and hope he might get a free kick. And out wide, they were in a good position until that defender acted very promptly and decisively. Silva. Aguero looking for the cross. Up for grabs here. CM Dion. Now here's a chance to get at the opposition. Manquillo. And then it goes towards the... Goes for it with a fist. Jesus Gámez. CM De Jong. Now Marino. Spotted well by the defender, cut it out. On the attack here. And he can clear it here. Jack Colback. Mikel Marino. Here's De Jong. Nice return pass. Real opening now. That's great hands from the goalkeeper to make that kind of save. Now Marino. Could be dangerous. Now Adson. Nodded back across goal. Silva. Still chance for something to happen because there's three added minutes. Three minutes of added time. It's a quick... He's got his shot off now. What a fine save. Manchester City get a corner. In goes the corner. A decent fist away by the keeper. And there is the half-time whistle. Nil-nil at the break. First half verdict on Kevin De Bruyne from Alan Smith. He worked hard enough, but just didn't come off for him. But he's got another half to put things right. Kick-off here for the start of the second half. Well, we've got an angle on this uh, offside call, Alan, I must say, it is the most difficult thing in all the officiating, I think, but this assistant has got eagle eyes. Well, I certainly wouldn't want to do that job because uh, the uh, speed that players move now as it turns out, what a great call. Now Fernandinho. Kyle Walker. Fernandinho. Nicholas Otamendi. That is a free kick. 
substitution for Newcastle United. Well, that's what substitutes are for to be used. And we've got one coming on now. Coming on to the pitch, number eight, John Joe Shelby. Oh, that's good defending. Silva. That's well worked by City here. And they're going forward with a real hint of menace about them. Aguero! And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Fernandinho. Good forward play from them. Walker. Aguero. Gabriel Jesus. Into the lead they go. It's a fine, well-worked goal from a team that's looking well-oiled and looking very well-drilled. They've been the better side, they've played with great panache up to this point. And that goal really sums up the way they have been playing. Excellent. Goalkeeper almost got there, but it wasn't a strong enough touch. Yeah, he's annoyed with himself, isn't he? Having got a touch on it feels he should have done better. Well, it's Manchester City in front. Mikel Marino. As for Newcastle United, their next game, Alan? Well, they're playing Burnley in their next... In on goal, Aguero. Easy save for Krul. It's good work between these two. Well, I like the look of this attack. Good defending. Well, that will be a free kick. For Manchester City. For Newcastle United. Well, they are behind, so it's time for a change. They've got to try and improve their performance somehow. Substitution for Manchester City. Can love the pitch. Number three, Daniel. To the new place for number 42, Yaya Torre. His company. They could pose some danger now. Kevin De Bruyne. It's Aguero. Now the shot. Shot blocked here. And that's really the way to get the ball out of the danger zone. And now he's looking for some support. Silva, proper tackle that. Kieran Clark, Fernandinho, Sergio Aguero. It's been a thrilling contest this, and we're into the last knockings of it. And the supporters, well, they're not showing any sign of losing their stamina. They've been great. Yeah, always love coming to this ground. One of the best atmospheres around. They've not disappointed. Jesus Gámez. Now Marino. A little too eager to get in behind the opposition. Caught offside. A substitute coming on. It's a tactical change. Substitution for Manchester City, the pitch, number 21, Coming on to the pitch, number 7, Raheem Sterling. Time 
Kyle Walker. Vincent Company. Still 1 0 here with the time almost up. What about this uh, impacting on the next game? Well, Manchester City go up against West Bromwich Albion. They've been below expectations out here. They need to improve. And the added time will amount to three minutes at least. Three minutes. To bring them level. And he's way off target. Well, the keeper might want to go forward himself, but he's sending his teammates up the field. It's finished now with the final whistle. Well, given their status in the match, Alan, clearly underdogs. Well, they'll be pretty happy with the way they played. I think so. Yeah, they can take... A lot from this performance moving forward. Might not have got the result they wanted, but they did well. Some final thoughts on one of the better performers today, Alan. Yeah, maybe the difference between the two sides. Really solid, really good performance from him.